Hey guys, Dr. David Lynn, board certified laser dermatologist. Today we'll be talking about does essential oil such as bio oil help with acne scarring, uh, stretch marks, anti-aging, as well as dehydrated skin, uneven skin tone in the lot? Short answer, no. <laughs> Here's the reason why. Um, acne scars are actually uh, lie deep in your skin. So there are two types of scarring. You can consider scars as pigmentation, so they're called type grade two or macular um, uh, acne scars, or PIE, post-inflammatory erythema. It used to be called macular erythema, but now they've been graded as grade two or PIE. Now, these aren't actually scars. These are actually areas of pigmentation, which will resolve in time. Acne scars can actually also occur due to contours or changes in the contours in your skin, and they can be graded accordingly, including ice pick scars, rolling scars, atrophic scars, box scar scars, and all these other scar types, including hypertrophic scars. Now, acne scars are due to um, basically inflammation which occurs deep in your layers of your skin. So it basically goes down seven layers, um, right down to the uh, reticula and papillary dermis. Now, creams do not go down that, do not go down all the way down to that depth. So, um, does bio oil help with acne scarring? The answer is no. In fact, um, it's been even theorized that it can actually make um, acne scars worse. Reason is being because uh, one of the active ingredients, or several of the active ingredients, contain. Um, extract from plants which can cause what's known as a photodermatosis. So in other words, when you put this on, you go to the, go outside, um, you get some sunlight. The sunlight basically causes a chemical reaction which can cause a photoallergic or um, photoirritant dermatitis. And that can lead to worsening of your scars. Second thing is that it contains um, many things like fragrances, preservatives, um, and even with the lavender oil and oil, irritants, which can put um, your skin more inflamed. In other words, um, you're putting stuff which is already inflamed uh, and you're putting it as something which causes more inflammation and hence that can perpetuate um, your scarring. So the other thing as well is that my gripe with this is that if you have scars which are on the way out, so you have red acne scars or even brown scars, you're putting this on acne prone skin. And this is something called a cominogenic um, substance. In other words, it can clog the pores and make things worse. So um, do I agree with this for both um, acne and acne scarring? Uh, the answer is absolutely not. Um, look, Dr. Dre is one of my favorite dermatologists. She tells it like it is. She's a little bit more, I guess, uh, persuasive than I am. and. Um, Here's her take on um, how this works for acne scarring and acne. You know, long story short, I don't think this is a good product. Um, I don't think it's good for acne prone skin, not because it has mineral oil or it's gonna clog your pores, but because acne is an inflammatory skin disease and putting fragrancy things on an inflammatory skin disease just sets the stage for more inflammation and worsening acne and worsening uh, what's called post-inflammatory hyperpigmentation or dark marks in the setting of healing acne or acne that's attempting to heal and go away, okay? So no, not good for acne prone skin, not good for a scar, okay? I mean, this is this is something that can definitely be very, very irritating. You. So that was her take on um, acne scarring together with um, how this product is. Um, I share the same view, um, seriously. It's, it's, um, if you like using it because it feels good, by all means use it. If you want to actually achieve something, um, this may not be a good product for you. The second thing I'm talking about is stretch marks. And um, I dug this video out. And this video is actually by Dr. Bao, who is actually B-O-W-E, who's actually the lead dermatologist for uh, bio oil. So she's what's known as the KOL, Key Opinion Leader for bio oil. Listen to what she has to say about um, how stretch marks should be treated. So want to look for products in either, you know, areas that are prone to stretch marks or after you've developed a stretch mark, 
products that contain vitamin A because vitamin A actually triggers collagen formation and collagen is what you need the most in a stretch mark. Stretch marks just don't have enough collagen and that's why they become so apparent to the eye. Um, that's how stretch marks should be treated. We should stimulate collagen and one of the most powerful collagen stimulators are actually vitamin A, right? Um, because that stimulates um, collagen formation and as a result more collagen your stretch marks become less noticeable whether they're old stretch marks or new stretch marks. Does bio oil contain any vitamin A? The answer is no, it contains vitamin E. Um, does vitamin E work for stretch marks? Well anything that's moisturizing can work for stretch marks. So do you want to buy something which I guess costs a lot more than what you should be paying for? The answer is no. So this isn't just said by me, this is said by the key opinion leader from bio oil is to actually use a vitamin A to stimulate collagen. So the answer is absolutely not. Um, and finally, for all the other things including uneven skin tone, aging and dehydrated skin, totally agree with Dr. Andrea Dre. Um, this is absolute no, I wouldn't say absolute rubbish. It's, let's be politically correct. It may not be the best solution for you um, because to treat uneven skin tone, aging skin, uh, dehydrated skin, you don't need to go to a mineral oil or paraben uh, sorry, a paraffin-based um, um, uh, oil. You can just use a simple moisturizer to repair your barrier. Uh, it's more cost-effective, uh, and in the long run. Uh, it gives you less chance of something going wrong. For example, an allergic or irritant contact dermatitis. So guys, I hope you enjoy that short segment on my take on essential oils. Uh, I'm not against it, remember. Um, if you like it, uh, if you actually like the fragrance, if you like um, the application, if it feels good, by all means use it. All the papers on bio oil actually show that patients like using it whether that equates to a clinical outcome, as in less scarring, less stretch marks, anti-aging, that's totally different. So the papers do actually say that patients like it, and I believe them because it actually smells nice and it feels good, but does it do something for your skin? Well, all we can do as dermatologists, uh, myself and my colleagues, is, pre is present the evidence before you and you make up that decision whether you want to use essential oils for your skin or not. Guys, I hope you like that um, video. That's a controversial video on a very, very well-known um, topic, bio oil. Um, and you can see many people actually saying, hey, this is the best stuff out here. We're just giving you the evidence. Um, unbiased and no conflict of interest. So guys, that's the end of the video. Uh, like I said, one new video every Saturday morning, Brisbane time. Please share, comment, like, uh, chime your thoughts below. Uh, if you just tell us what you think about bio oil. Um, and like I said, not against it. It's just if you want something to, if you want something for your scars or you want something for your stretch marks, this may not be the product for you. See you same time, same place next week. Bye for now.